I wish I could uh, tell a little white lie about this and act like I was uh, on a whaling ship or some fisherman story. Uh, you expect a lie out of a fisherman anyway, right? Uh, but I, in truth, it was just some picture I saw, uh, I believe on uh, National Geographic one time, and I particularly liked uh, everything about it and tried to see if I could uh, come near a painting. And uh, it was a photograph, not a painting. So, uh, but the colors are very, real soft and everything. And actually, I was uh, pretty much of a beginner at this time just learning to paint. And uh, I started out as a uh, oil painter and found that, tried to find some other way that would uh, save the paints. I was always wasting a lot of the oils because you put it out and you wouldn't use it all and then you'd lose it. Now I found, well, I can paint watercolors same way I paint oils, but I don't have the weights to it. It'll last. Even if it dries up, I can uh, put water to it and it'll usually come back. And so this was a, a very early uh, painting of, of my uh, journey as a painter. When was this painted? In the 60s? Or? Uh, Maybe, maybe 60s or late 50s. It doesn't have a signature, does it? Uh, I don't see one unless it's down under the, the uh, mat there. Uh, it's been so long I don't remember. Maybe you can sign it today. Yeah, I usually sign. I probably signed it. It's it's probably slipped down a little, maybe or something. Or in order to frame it and put a mat, I probably had to cover the name. And at that point, I wasn't selling my paintings anyway. So uh, yeah, after all, I didn't sell this one. It's still, yep. it's still in the family. Mm -hmm. It always will be. Good enough.